We went over the rules in the dressing room. Let's have a good, clean fight. Touch them up. When you get a fight like this that everybody's been talking about, it's always so interesting to see these opening moments here in round number one. That was a fine block by Manny Pacquiao. Be interested to see early on here how much an advantage there is with speed. Manny Pacquiao's full of it. He has blazing hands, Teddy. Can he keep it up all night long? I think he's going to have to. You're doing great. And just grabbing on to his opponent. Back to the box. Decide to trade there. Pacquiao's well off the mark that time. Halfway through Let's round number head. one. Let's see some more head get out of the way. Able to block that away. It was targeted for his head. Go on. In and out. In and out. In and out. Let's move. Oh, he took some damage, but he gave some back with the right hand. Keep moving, working the jab. Pacquiao's blocking ability is doing well for him there. Targeting that straight left hand. Solid right by Manny Pacquiao. That left hand over the top, he's accurate with it. What a great job. He gave one right back in return. Nice work by Manny Pacquiao. This round comes to an end. A round in which this fighter threw a lot of punches, didn't land a lot of punches. I'll tell you, what advice can you give to him if you're the trainer? Well, first of all, deal with the psychological part. Joe, don't forget, 75% of this game is psychological. Don't let him get discouraged because even though he's not going to say nothing, in his head he's starting to get discouraged. Just say to him, hey, listen, you're going to catch him. Let's shorten him up a little bit. And you know what? He's moving his head, so go to the body. Because now you're going to hit him a little in the body because the body's not moving. Well, supposed to be fighting, but instead he's hugging. He tried to nab him up top but was unable to connect. Oh, what an uppercut. Halfway through round number two. Keep it going. Teddy, early on here, you cannot stress enough how much good comes from going to the body. And you can't stress how many times you heard your parents tell you as a kid, Put that change into the piggyback because it's going to add up. Well, body punches add up. The natural's left, landing well. Solid hook upstairs. Manny Pacquiao's getting himself into the mix now, landing that left hand. The natural's knowledge of the game is showing through. Three ways to defend. One of them is the block. He did it there well. Listen, you need to move your head from side to side, okay? I want to see that head move. Number three is underway. Pull the trigger on that overhand left. Targeting each other, the exchange was something special. The Naturals' punches just don't look like what they should look like right now, Teddy. I know he's thrown a lot early on here, but there's no oomph on them. 
Well, that's the other side of it. There's always a flip side to a coin, and the flip side here in the boxing ring, yeah, he threw a lot of punches, but they didn't affect the guy. Right now, I think he's giving in a little bit. Pacquiao's done a good job there offensively scoring with that left hand. It seemed like Pacquiao was waiting for a counterpunch opportunity. That time he timed it well, blocked and scored. The Naturals left working well that time. Not hitting his mark there going upstairs. That's great stuff. He fires one right back after taking one. Gotta love the work by Manny Pacquiao. The Naturals giving his opponent headaches here now. He's throwing punches, but he's able to block them away. Scored well up top. Manny Pacquiao's got a cut. It looks like it's below the eye on the cheek, but it's something that needs to be monitored. Wow, is he defensively sound. Keep moving. Hey, you got some of that too. Let's go. Good flush, straight left hand. Good step back, counter punch. Right. Beautiful. Quick snapping hook, and it does damage. Scores big with the hook to the head. And that's the end of round three. So as we start round four, we reflect on the first three, looking at Teddy's scorecard. Pacquiao's earned good marks, taking all three rounds. Yeah, not eventful some of the rounds. Not a lot to separate the two guys. But I think that his jab has carried the day. Nice! Able to show you his blocking ability. You know, Pacquiao has improved through the years as a defensive fighter. He's got great speed and movement, but also much more sound defensively. Here's one for you now, he says, right back with the left hand. Focus. Nice block. Pacquiao's in a good rhythm defensively here. Teddy, what is that, a credit to his ability to anticipate? You know, also, it's the teaching. Let's give the trainers credit. Of course, let's give his background of the amateurs credit, but he learned how to get away from punches. This is technique that was taught to him. on the mark with that overhand left. That uppercut absolutely rocked him. Well, I don't like the way his legs look at all right now. Fourth round now with its last 10 seconds. Oh, and he returns fire with a left hand. Don't fight his fight. Jab and move. So this round is underway, and what a difference a break makes for him. Look at how fresh he is to start this round after getting hit hard and rocked in that last round. What a difference a rest makes when the corner knows how to take advantage of that rest. They got water on him, they revived him, they massaged his legs a little bit, gave him some encouragement, good to go. The Naturals now feeling the effects, Teddy, of having his opponent punch right through that guard. Well, he should feel the effects. I mean, look, Joe, it's kind of like standing out in a rainstorm with an umbrella, and, and all of a sudden the wind's coming, and the rain's coming from the side, and you're standing there under the umbrella and say, why am I getting wet? Well, you're standing there covering up. The punches are coming from the side. They're coming from all angles. You're going to get wet. You're not always protected. <laughs> Halfway into round number five here. That worked out really well. Throwing off the right hand after getting tagged like that. 
miss the body shot. There it is! He just fought the other guy's fight, and now it's not his fight at all. He is down. No, he should have been on the inside. He pulled out, pulled out into a world of trouble, a world of punches. Two, three, four, five. He gets up after that punch put him down on the canvas. Now he needs to get on that bicycle and stay away from this guy. Got to try to do better than that. He missed with that hook. Manny Pacquiao is able to land a good, solid left hand. Nice block that time. It was intended to the head. Here's a moment here as you see the step back counter punch where you realize this is the sweet science, not just some raw savagery. And yet another big shot comes in. Late goings here of this round, and he goes down. Can he survive it? One, two, three, four, five. And it's over. This fight is over. The Naturals, unable to beat the count. Knockout loss for him. Pacquiao's your winner by knockout. Now, I think he was headed towards a decision win anyways, but what a good way to just put a stamp on his evening. Yeah, bring down the curtain and make sure that more people are going to be talking about you when they leave the arena tonight. I'm Joe Tessitore for Teddy Atlas saying thanks for being with us and enjoy the rest of your night.